Kazakhstan, meanwhile, excels in uranium mining. Country holds over 700,000 tons in proven reserves, with exporting routes vary from Canada to China. New Times reporter Baljan Semigulina explored the future of the uranium industry of Kazakhstan and possibilities for international cooperation in this field. Let's have a look. Since 2009, Kazakhstan has emerged as a global powerhouse in the realm of uranium mining. The Central Asian nation contributes over 40 percent of the world's national uranium production. Annually, Kazakhstan produces up to 10 tons of uranium. That is, at the head of Kazatomprom national company set a benchmark for Kazakhstan production. For the first nine years, uh, nine months of this year, there is an insignificant dec decrease in production. So uh, this is mainly due to limited access to materials, like uh, we have sulfuric acid in our uh, raw materials, uh, so uh, there were some delays in supplying that. But uh, our expectations for, for the 2023 remain unchanged, so uh, we, we still plan to produce that we have planned. The logics for the future development of uranium industry in the country that has the vast reserves and counts for almost half of global production is clear, experts say. Rational in this regard would be the decision of constructing first ever nuclear power plant in Kazakhstan. The head of Kazakhstan Atomic Power Plants Company, Timur Jantikin, said, adding that people of Kazakhstan will decide the future of this project on the upcoming referendum. Uh, I hope that uh, the population of our country will support the development of nuclear power because we are for development of nuclear power because we have the well-developed nuclear uh, industry as you know that we are providing uh, now now we have the fuel fabrication plant mm -hmm. providing fuels for Chinese and uh, this is the top of the fuel uh, cycle and uh, very logical to continue with the nuclear power plant. Kazakh Ministry of Energy has already made the preliminary steps by identifying potential vendors for the projects. These are the companies from Russia, China, Korea and France. The French leader Emmanuel Macron visited Kazakhstan just recently and as media reported, the primary topic in bilateral discussions could be identifying uranium import from Kazakhstan and future participation of French investors in the uranium and projects of Central Asian region. However, in an interview to New Time, editor-in-chief of French media Noah Stan underlined that France would not entirely focus on one particular route, even if taking into account some production chains disruptions in other parts of the world. She added that uranium partnership with Kazakhstan is nonetheless essential for France. We have enough resources for, for the short term, so it's not really urgent. But of course, uh, there is a need to uh, somehow uh, have the diversification of partners and to reinforce uh, partnership uh, with Kazakhstan. I don't think the French states want to rely too much on Kazakhstan, not to uh, depend on uh, one, one uh, place of supply only, because uh, Kazakhstan is already 40% of France's uranium, so it's already a lot. The mineral-rich Central Asia tends to become a reliable energy supplier. That's the vision which is commonly shared by Kazakhstan and its partners. Experts forecast that Kazakhstan's uranium export will grow, making a case for enhancing partnership with other countries and opening opportunities in the industry. Baljan Samigulina, Sakem Pioneer, Silkui TV Channel, Astana. Being a significant player at global uranium market, Kazakhstan builds its own ambitions of further developing this industry, understanding its own potential of transforming into a major regional energy supplier.